Hello and welcome to this video on using dictation or speech to text in Word Online. So for this you'll need an Outlook or Office account which is free to sign up at office.com. You'll need to be using a supported browser which is either Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge and you'll need to navigate to office.com forward slash launch forward slash word and click on new blank document and you should see the screen in front of you right now. So to start dictation click on this dictate button. It should start up automatically dictating as in the microphone will be red but I'll go through that in a moment. So I click on dictate. You might have heard that little chime and it's currently listening to everything I'm saying. I'm trying not to look at the screen because that sometimes puts people off if you are trying to dictate and follow the text at the same time. So I'm going to click on the microphone to turn off and then that's stopped uh, listening to me. So you, you might notice a little uh, grey line under the text here and that's if the microphone didn't pick you up correctly. So you can say click to view suggestions. So did you say time or just ignore that? So because it wasn't a spelling mistake it was a little grey line underneath. So this I'm, I can correct that to capital I. And then here's the little window that will appear at the bottom. So here in the little cog for dictation settings, if I click on this, you can turn on or off auto punctuation or turn on or off voice commands. I have mine set to English UK. It might default to English US when you start, start it up for the first time. So I'm going to go back to my document here. Just enter a new line and start dictation again, but this time I'll try a few commands. So I'll just move that window over there. So click it on. So I'm going to try and use a few commands, full stop, new line, and that is how to add a new line and a full stop comma in a document. So that's a quick run through of getting your thoughts, ideas verbally out by automatically typing it on the screen. So Word Online has an added feature that it will save or constantly save so you don't have to worry about losing any work. And you can actually download these uh, documents as a Word file or a PDF document as well by clicking on File and Save As there on the left. So that's a quick run through of using uh, Word Dictation, which again is free. And thank you.